Greetings everyone, Lee's Fun Entertainment here, and welcome to my DVD, Blu-ray and CD update for the 20th of June, 2021. So in total, I have 8 DVDs, and 1 Blu-ray, and 2 CDs. I'm going to show you right now, today, on Lee's Fun Entertainment. <laughs> Okay then, let's get started. So the first one I'm going to show you is Scooby-Doo, The Sword and the Scoob, the original movie. Yeah, this is a, another newest Scooby-Doo movie that recently came out in, I think it was February. And I got this at Asta in the 29th of May, I think it was. No, it must be the 30th. There we go, there's the back. Mystery Inc. goes medieval. There we go, we've got some screenshots there. So it looks like Scooby and the gang going back in time to the King Arthur's days. Which that would be really quite interesting for me for me to watch. And then we also got three bonus cartoons, which I'm not sure what they are. I imagine probably some Scooby-Doo um, TV shows on there. So take out the slip cover, and there we go, we got this um, security protective um, sticker stuck on the front of the, the cover. And here it comes the slip cover, and just the same old plain slip cover is not like nothing really too special about it, it's just just the same old plain slip cover. Okay, let's crack this baby open. And we're going to take a look inside. There we go. Same thing with the... About the slip cover. So here is the disc. And yep. In a black disc. No artwork unfortunately. As usual. So nothing else here to say. And I forgot to read you the rating. Ray you, Mild Comic Threat and Violence, and this was 73 minutes. So there you go, that is the new Scooby-Doo movie, The Sword and the Scoop. Definitely looking forward to watching that. And I'm not done with Scooby-Doo, I also got another brand new Scooby-Doo DVD. And that is Scooby-Doo and Guess Who? The Complete First Season. And yeah, this is another brand new Scooby-Doo television show, which I have not seen. Which I'll definitely check this one out. It's got all 26 episodes. As you can see here. I'll let you pause and read and read the description for yourselves. There we go. Ray PG, very mild violence, threat, scary scenes. This was 72 minutes. There we go, came with a very plainish slip cover as usual. Nothing really too special about it. Just the same old plain slip cover. And then here is the case itself. Let's crack this one open. And let's check out the discs. Well, that's a bit different. Instead of having one of those four disc cases, which the discs are like stacked each other. You know what I mean by that? But now, it's a bit different. Now the discs are in a nice separate trays. Which that's more like it, doesn't it? There we go. And then we also got the same leaflet as from the uh the Tom and Jerry DVD, but it's but it's a Scooby Doo version. As you can see here. So it's just a bit like the Tom and Jerry leaflet, 
where you got the advertisements for these um, Scooby-Doo toys and DVDs and then we also got a colouring sheet and then on the back we've got the uh, the advertising for the Tom and Jerry movie which I also done an unboxing a double unboxing of this if you want to check this out on my channel so there you go that's Scooby-Doo and guess who the complete first season Next, we've got Tarzan. Yeah, Disney's 37th anime classic. There we go. And even though I already had the second um, director DVD movie and the Tarzan and Jane director DVD movie, and because at the time I didn't actually have the first Tarzan, so now I do. So there we go. Liking additional Disney's uh, classics with the uh, lovely shiny slip cover, and you got the character on the front. There we go. We've got some bonus features here. We've got uh, deleted scenes and music videos, games and activities, and this is also Ray Yu contains small violence, and this runs about eighty-five minutes. So there we go. Let's take this shrink wrap off. So you can get a better look at the front cover without that stupid security protective sticker on there. There we go. Here's a better up close look of the front cover. Looks really nice. And there is the back. <clears throat> Take a look inside. So there we go. Um, it's in a born greyish disc. So there we go. Nothing really too special. So there we go. That's Tarzan. And now we've got some DVDs I got from the charity shops in Froome. So I'm going to show you the first two DreamWorks movies I've got at Dorothy House. Here is Shrek the Musical, the award-winning Broadway musical. There we go. A big fat hit, USA Today. They've got bonus features. Shrek the Musical, songbook with seven sing-alongs. And then we've got Ray Yu contains very mild language, innuendo, and rude humor. And this goes on about 130 minutes. Here's a disc. Really nice. If you're a big fan of Shrek, this is a must have. Um, they also had the Blu ray of this as well, which I didn't know that they did the Blu ray set, but I've got a DVD version of this instead, so. That's okay. Next, we got The Prince of Egypt. Another one of the DreamWorks movies I don't have in my collection. And I finally did. Um, I also saw uh, The Spirit uh, on D DVD. But I'm going to get Spirit um, differently. Because I'm going to get the, uh, the uh, DVD with the TV series included. Which I don't know when. I'll definitely grab that at some stage. Next we've got one from Dor not Dorothy House. A British Heart Foundation. We've got The Wild Things Are. Based on the book of the same name. A must see for all ages. Five star Sunday people. I remember I did see this movie when I was in school once. It's a long time ago. But I'm going to have to watch this film. Um, see what I think of it. Let the Wild Rum Start, one of my favourite films of the year, Jonathan Ross film 2009, 5 stars total film. Now you got the bonus features, we've got series of Where the Wild Things Are, short by Lance Bangs, and the absolute, absolute diff difficult of filming a dog running and barking at the same time, crew prank spike, vampire attacks, and the Max Wreck. The Max Records shoot and the kids take take over the picture. 
There we got PG contains small threat and brief violence. And this is nine ninety-seven minutes. There we got the disc. Really nice full colored artwork. I haven't read you the um the ratings on the Prince of Egypt. Uh Rayu contains small by Biblical horror, and this is 99 minutes. So there we go, that's the wild things are. And now we've got some other two DVDs I got from uh, uh, Red Cross in Westbury. So here we got uh, Muppets Take Manhattan. There we go, we've got a, uh, a Muppet DVD. No bonus features. It's Ray Yu, and this was one hour and 30 minutes. Then we got a disc. A plain shiny disc. So there we go. That's Muppets Take Manhattan. And last but not least for the DVDs, we also got Monster House. Ooh, that looks scary, isn't it? <laughs> and this was. This was done by Robert Zemeckis and Steven Spielberg. Frightly funny, four stars, Daily Mirror. Spine, we've got the back. A generally exciting, pleasing, spooky thrill ride. Then we've got bonus features. We've got seven featurettes, imaginary heroes, beginners, luck, the best, the best of friends, lots of dots, black, black box theater, making it real. Did you hear that? Multi-angle evolution. Eliza versus ne Nebel Cracker, filmmakers' commentary, the art of Monster House, photo gallery. The adventure continues online with DVD ROM linked to exciting games, downloads, and activities. And then we got the way PG contains scary scenes and mild language. One hour and twenty six minutes. Here's the disc. So there we go. So that's the DVDs. Now I'm going to be showing a brand new Disney title, which I'll be definitely looking forward to watching it. Raya and the Last Dragon. This is Disney's 58th anime classic. There we go. This movie was originally supposed to be in theaters, but this one's got a Disney Plus exclusive. And also, for stupid reason, they decided to put the new Disney Pixar Luca on Disney Plus instead of going to feeders. <sighs> That's just great. Anyways, up there with the very best of Disney, The Times. And then we also got a bonus features and the introduction to Us Again, Us Again, Taste of Raya, Raya bringing it home. Martial Arts, We Are Kamina, Outtakes, Fun Facts and Easter Eggs, The Story Behind the Storyboards with John Ripper, and Five Deleted Scenes, Ray PG, More Violence Threat, and this runs about 107 minutes. There we go, it was the normal standard blue disc with no artwork. Nothing else to say. So there you go, that's Raya and the, and the Last Dragon. Can't wait to watch this. So that is the DVDs and Blu-rays. Now I'm going to be showing you what CDs I've got. And this is the one I've actually found at, at the same time when I got the other two DreamWorks DVDs. And I saw this and I was like... Oh wow, I gotta get this. So I got not one, but two Fantasia soundtracks. Yes, yeah, so this is disc one, and that's disc two. So here is disc one. Really nice. It also contains all nine tracks. 
So I'll let you pause and read and read the tracks for yourselves. Here we go. Then we also got a note from the composer. And then when you open it up, it gives you the entire track list for each, both discs. There we go. Really nice. Fantasia is one of the greatest Disney movies of all time. I mean, I actually watched Fantasia just last year, uh, before the whole pandemic started, because at the time, I, w I really wanted to get into watching some Disney stuff, and when I watched Fantasia, it is an amazing film. I love this movie so much, and especially the animation and the music. It's freaking beautiful. And I have not seen Fantasia 2000, so I definitely need to watch that. So you've got the rest of the tracks. There we go, we've got the same lever as before. So there you go. That is Fantasia. Soundtracks. Really nice. If you're if you love Fantasia or if you love if you're a big fan of Disney then this is a must-have soundtrack if you're a massive Disney fan. So there you have it! That's my DVD, Blu-ray and CD update for the 20th of June 2021. I hope you guys enjoy it. Sorry I haven't uploaded any videos for a while, but don't worry, there are some brand new videos coming up your way. I still need to continue doing my Super Mario 64 gameplay, get it done out of the way, and I really need to do my movie reviews, so... So if you guys new here to this channel, please consider hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to turn on your notification bell, so you never miss brand new videos coming up very soon. Make sure to give a like to this video, and leave a comment below, uh, what you think of this video, and there you go. I'll see you guys next time. This is Lee's Fun Entertainment, signing out.